uh, guess where I'm landing back at, though? Back to... Oh no, bitch, I'm coming back. I'm going to fly there on my parachute. Let's kick the beat. my better gameplays that I had uh, that were up there. It was like 13 kills or some shit like that. I got killed by a fucking... They used an airstrike on me. Those guys were third-partying my fight after I just wiped those dudes and then they just called an airstrike on top of me instead. <laughs> Smart move by them to be fair because they were just funneling in one after another. I have no idea where the other two guys were but the other dude tried to walk up there. He got fucking lasered and then the airstrike came. Ended up hitting 155 and completed a fuck ton of these. I actually think one of these challenges are broken though. The four-piece dinner challenge I believe is broken i have gotten multiple quad feeds it says earn one four piece medal four uninterrupted kills in the kill feed i get like more than five ten fucking quad whether that's with an airstrike uh, sweating on people sniper rifle it's just it doesn't it's not counting I, I don't understand. I did it yesterday multiple times. No idea why that's not working. At this point, I've been hoping that uh, the Warzone classes would actually be different from multiplayer classes. They need to separate the loadouts, in my opinion. And too much time trying to, like, adjust my weapons and shit like that whenever I'm swapping between the game modes and stuff. We'll go back to Warzone. Somebody put in the comment section of yesterday's video where they were like, whenever Jeb goes and plays Phil, it's like he's playing solo but with a handicap. I basically handicap myself, though, in that process just because I feel the need so heavily to help my friends, or teammates, at least. I know everybody's running thermal HDRs and shit all over the place. I yet to really touch thermal or whatever. A couple other people have been tweeting their suggestions and stuff. It seems like a lot of uh, people are having problems with uh, loadouts and stuff. If you go into multiplayer and try to snipe, it's uh, it's a whole different ball game than sniping in Warzone. Sniping in Warzone, it's the way that people are building their weapons in Warzone that make them as effective as they are over the distances that they are. Like, of course, you're gonna get lasered across the entire map with a thermal the dude has thermal on with an hdr 26.9 inch pro barrel of course it's gonna travel at the speed of light i mean i wouldn't really mind if they removed the loadouts and stuff like that i mean it's a lot less people that i end up running into that are super souped up and shit so could make it easier for me in turn um. <laughs> I, I can tell you do that a whole bunch buddy oh a heartbeat sensor right in here oh yeah It's really annoying that the plate only replenishes the current plate that it's on unless it's like 80% of it or some shit like that. That's the only time it ever actually changes. I know that it's half damaged and therefore that actually does make sense, but it's just... I was actually using the M13 last night in uh, in multiplayer trying to do all the stupid ass little challenges and stuff like that for the officer challenges. I really wouldn't mind if they got rid of the loadouts and stuff like that or make it so you can't buy it from the station and then only make them world drops. Make them world drop only and then maybe even potentially limit certain items. I, I, I don't know. It's whatever. I mean, really, the game could stay this way. I don't really mind. Yeah, obviously, I mean, this is currently what the meta is, but it doesn't really need to change that much, to be honest. Thermal sniper rifles. Hey, if you're going to get sniped, you're gonna get sniped it is what it is i think the uh the heartbeat sensor is so fucking god tier like i mean yeah people can have their counters to it but if they're lower level players for example or not nearly as geared players they're not going to have anything to be able to counter this thing there's nothing that they're going to be able to do the main thing that i like getting from my loadouts are the perks it has nothing really to do with the weapons like everybody keeps concentrating on the weapons so hard but i mean i can see how the how the thermal is really strong obviously i mean characters are bright as fuck army behind the wall Uh, around, the, around the corner, around the, around the, behind you, around the corner. Oh, really? You're gonna finish. The whole 
fucking team is there? Holy shit. I wanna give you a kiss, Jeff. <laughs> Jesus. Thank you, man. I appreciate that. I'm fucking stunned, man. They would stun me because they know they ain't gonna try that 1v3. You better stun me. Yeah, I'm gonna just go solo. I, I just stress myself out so much listening to my teammates. I hate feeling like I put pressure on people just by like sitting there. Like I don't say anything to anybody, but I just feel like most people I come across are nice people. They're not bad people or mad people or mean people or anything like that. But then there are just people out there that just like they're, they're so stressed out and they want to do well and they want the game to go well that it's just like it's really hard to not care about, you know, what shape my teammates are in based Based on, you know, whatever it is that they have or if they just like get fucking absolutely slaughtered by th this group of players or whatever. Like I just, I feel bad. So I want to bring them back all the time, but it always it gets me killed. I pay attention to them. And then after they die, they all pay attention to me and they're all cheering for me. I don't fucking like that pressure. I don't like that. Stop. Not every single time. It's just, no, 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 no. I'd rather play solo and just be like, oh, well, I died. It's 1v3. Darn, I couldn't win. Nobody even really feels good about killing a solo. So it's the best I can do to just, I'll deal with it myself by myself. Actually got a pretty decent loadout right here. I got short stuff and piercer. Pretty good variants of these guns. This guy doesn't hear me. Hello. I'm gonna jump down, jack this helicopter, and take the fuck off. Fucking see ya! Nice knowing you guys, but uh, you you'll find a way out eventually. Somehow. I hate this whole city area, to be honest. I really do. I think I'm gonna fly over to hills, actually. I want to see where uh, if anybody went over there. I don't know if anybody would land over there, so it should be pretty clear. Although, I'm completely ready to just go and fight some people. I'm gonna need self-revive and a few other things. Stopping power rounds. I will load these in, and then I will take dead silence. Stopping power in this mode is a little ridiculous, too. I, uh, at some points, I've gotten the stopping power rounds, uh, foul, and I'm headshotting people, and they will literally drop in, like, three bullets. It's kind of ridiculous. I'm really surprised stopping power rounds are even in this mode. All right, so there's a team all the way over here and of course he's on the roof i mean why wouldn't he be just screams insecurity i'm one of the most insecure people i know in my entire life i know insecurity when i see it where the fuck is everybody i'm looking for people to fight and kill and shit a little bit you know i'm surrounded by three teams right now there's some teams in that building these guys are over here buying and then there's another team sat i need to take a vehicle or just pick a team and fight them i'm gonna have to like trickle in behind these guys yeah, I can see them. Where the fuck did that guy go? Did he leave the game? He must have escaped over this way. How the fuck? Did that dude take off immediately? I saw him, and then I was trying to wait for- Oh, wait, I see him. It's really bad. These guys are up on the building up there, and these guys are all gonna be funneling over here. I have to try to get inside before these guys make it here. I have to make sure they don't see me either, though. This is gonna be really, really close. Enemy team. Evade and survive. Either they kept rotating over or they're waiting to come inside. Oh, shit! You ain't gonna hit nothing. Not even close, buddy. You tried shooting at me. Who, who, where are your teammates? You wanted this fight. You blew my shit up. I've still seen people complain about uh, console players. It's really weird. It's like people don't realize that you can plug in a controller on PC as well. But okay, so there's a team that's going to be coming in behind me. If I can get into this building up ahead, there's a whole team inside. Coming right up the stairs. I don't think I heard any of those guys actually climb up to the roof, though. spectate till you're dead motherfucker they fucking sat outside and waited for me it's just little situations like that like if a whole team has you pinned they will never give up on them. they hang on to that shit and swear by it like a fucking college degree they guarantee that shit will work every time Fair play what else are they gonna fucking do you know what i mean if they know they got a free kill there why wouldn't they take it right This is the guy that killed me. And there they go. They left the game. Hey, at least you got the one kill on me. I'm mad as shit if you haven't noticed. Top seven situations. There are only three groups left. Right here we got Psycho and Lepkev. Lep. Le
Kev, I'm, I'm gonna... His name is Kev. So that fucking Odin is no joke. That thing, I believe, does over 70 damage per bullet. Meaning, a lot of closer range shots to the upper chest. You can kill somebody in four or five shots. It's very, on average, a very, very consistent weapon. Psycho just sitting inside in the background, sitting in the fucking garden, waiting and shit, marking all the other players on the other team. They're actually fighting. Still three groups of players here. The final circle is starting to close in. You guys have to move. Who is going to win here? Somebody ends up invading. He's pushing through. He ends up going down. Kev and Psycho go down the cross. Get inside here, but they're not going to be able to stay inside for very long. They're looting up, but I don't think they realize what they just didn't have. They don't really have anything that'll help them in this scenario. They have everything that they need. Mass mass, but he looks over to his right. There's a lot of smoke. There's players laying on the ground. He's taking some shots out of armor down. Player down. Bosses the C4. He's down. LeBron James gets dunked on. We got Cross, your winner. Tullius P2. And dog shit. <laughs> oh, man. I love this fucking game.